I'm going to show you how to cheaply and easily connect your Jackery to a solar panel using this I Greeley device adapter that I got from Amazon. So stay tuned. So today I'm going to show you how to hook up a solar panel, uh, a very inexpensive way to hook up a solar panel to charge your Jackery, which I got this at Harbor Freight. So first we want to do, take a look here, and we see that we're at 100% power. So what I want to do first is discharge this. I'm going to hook it up to something. So I'll let this Dremel tool run for a little while until we get below 100%. All right, second thought, I didn't want to burn my Dremel tool out so by letting it keep running. So I hooked this uh, fluorescent light. So this fluorescent light is being powered by the Jackery. It is at 99%. Let that run a while, and we'll see if we can charge it up with solar. So while that is running, we need to figure out on the input, is the center positive or negative? Or is the, uh, you know, is the center positive or is the outside positive? And the way you do that is you can get the adapter that comes with it, and you want to look for this little symbol right here, okay? And if you see that little symbol, the positive right there, the positive is going toward the center. So that means it's center positive. So when we go to hook up this I Greeley adapter I got from Amazon, we've got to make sure the center is positive. So as you can see with this Greeley adapter, it comes with your main cable cord. Uh, we need the eight millimeter adapter. This goes into here, okay? So we take this, and we put it on here, and we will need to use this also. Now, there's no way of knowing which one's positive without testing it, so we're gonna have to put a voltmeter on it and test it. So this Nature Power solar panel comes with this little charge controller, but with the Jackery, you're not gonna need this, but you will need this if you're just gonna charge a re regular old battery, lead acid battery. Uh, so what we need to do is take this, and connect it to our adapter and see if the positive is, I mean, if the center is positive or negative. And we're gonna do that with a voltmeter. All right, currently the solar panel is putting out 23 volts and we know that the positive is the one in the sheath and the negative is the open one here. And the reason we know that is because it is not negative. So if I flip them, you'll see a negative sign. Watch as you see, it is now negative 22 volts because I have them switched. So we know that the positive is inside of this part and this is the negative. So we're one step closer. All right, and the Greeley adapter comes with this little device. This little device is made to flip the polarity. See, without that adapter, it will go together just like this. But if I put this adapter on it, it flips it. So if your polarity is reversed, you can use this to just flip it around. So that's the neat thing about this. So let's hook it up and see. We're gonna hook it up without the adapter and see if we get the center positive first. All right, I have it hooked up center with the positive red. I'm gonna to touch this, 22 volts. So as I see, I do not need this adapter to make that center positive. So now the only thing I've got to do is plug this eight millimeter adapter in. All right, I now have the solar panel hooked up. I've got it going into the Jackery. It says it's receiving 12 watts of input at 97%. So we'll see how long it takes to charge it up. And as I adjust the solar panel, watch, the wattage will go down. See, it went down to 12 watts. 13 as I raise it. If I flip it sideways, it goes down to nothing. So we'll let it sit just like that for now. Just after a few minutes, we are now back at 100% charge on the Jackery using this small 22 watt solar panel. So this little setup, Jackery from Harbor Freight, I got this on clearance from Academy. Um, again, it's only 22, up to 22 watts. And this little um, device from Amazon called I Greeley Adapter to work with that. It's a very inexpensive setup for your camping or overlanding uh, adventure. With this setup, it's very inexpensive to get you a battery and solar solution. So 
As usual, thanks for watching. I'll leave a link to these items in the description, and I'll also take a close-up picture of that part number on that uh, adapter. So have a great weekend.